This is Coogan Cassius for I Film London. We're at Lux here in Loughton for the book launch. The only way is up by this woman here, Chloe Sims. How are you, Chloe? I'm all right. How are you? I've had a really good night. We've interviewed some great people. We've met some great people. Everyone loves you, so it's all good. Coogan, have you had a look at the sweet cart behind me? The sweet cart behind me, candy cart, is amazing. Let's just open up. Listen, Coogan's been all over that sweet car like shit. Did you know that? Listen, you've launched your book tonight. It's out. The only way is up. What can people expect to see in the book or read in the book? Well, that's my autobiography. Obviously, I'm 31. Ouch. So am I. Easy. Are you? Yeah. Oh God, we're old. We're old. No, but listen, it's 31 years of my life. And um, I decided to do it. I was scared. But I've done it because people look at me on the TV show and think that I just landed there. And I had like all Rose's life before I got there. But in reality, it was really hard work getting there <laughs> and getting her. So I just wanted, there's a few secrets I had. And I wanted to say them in my own words rather than somebody else saying them not in the right way. I wanted to explain why it happened, where it happened, and how it happened, and how I got here today. And also, you know, I'm a single mum, I'm from Essex. Woo! Woo! And I wanted people to see that, yeah, somebody who comes from nothing, who is from Essex, and a single mum, can make something good out of their life. If, work, if you work really hard, and you've got good determination, it's all about work, isn't it? You've got to work hard. If you want to take in this world, you've got to work for it. Obviously, um, I spoke to your dad earlier on. I tried to get him on here. He said that um, he wouldn't come on here. He said if he wants to talk boxing, he will, but he didn't want to come on here otherwise. So uh, I don't know what to say about that. My dad's a sportsman. If you ain't going to talk about boxing, you might as well just leave it. And that's what I say to any guys that I meet. Do you like boxing? If you don't, you might as well forget it. Don't even talk to my dad because he's not interested. And I've also met your brother. My brother is exactly the same. He's really quiet. They're really hard to get a conversation out of. If you're not related to them or that like, have got any relevance, they will not talk to you. I know you've done your speech and you've thanked just about everyone in the world, but is there anyone out there that you want to say thanks to again that have, you know, been influential in where you are today? There is one person that I was going to thank in my speech, but he couldn't make it because he's not in the country. And that's Mr. Starship. This one's for you. I didn't mention him because he wasn't here. And then unless you've read the book or know me really closely, you wouldn't know who he was. But Mr. Starship is the love of my life. And if it wasn't for him, let's face it, it'd be a bit boring. <laughs> he made the book pretty interesting. <laughs> so, lots of love to him. And I know he's a fan of I Film London because he likes the one from the polo with me and Maria Fowler. The X-rated one. Yeah, he loves that. Um, so, yeah, I just want to thank him for showing me what real love is, really. Oh. On a scale of one to ten, how drunk are you? Am I even that drunk? I'm just shouting because we're turning the max all up in my grill. <laughs> Am I a little bit too close to your grill? No, but you know what? I've still got the young view from the box in with a turnout. He smacked me on the head with that shit. <laughs> Let me interview you. Hi, I'm Chloe from I Film London, and I'm interviewing the infamous Coogan. Cassius. Cassius. Mouth for an L. Right, Coogan, so basically you're down at the book launch with my book, The Only Way's Up. How are you feeling? Hiya! I'm feeling really good. Uh, oh my God, sorry to cut you off. <laughs> Listen, as much as he's going to talk about something interesting, Starship! You know, I love my life, I just spoke about. That is fake.
great because I just wanted to thank him and our songs come on. Mr. Starship, this one's for you. Let's ask you one question. That, that video of you and Maria Fowler, is that the guy in the background? Yes! He likes golden eggs! Hey! Chicken! Oh, you're quite famous, like. You was in the background of that video of her and Maria Fowler, and everyone was always asking, what was that guy doing? That so guy, what were you doing? He was laying golden eggs. His name's hey, chicken. You know what? That guy was doing the wonder. Yeah, it's called the wonder dream. Yeah, it's better than Ryan Giggs. Scoring the best goal, yeah. At Ivory, just felt so good because that's the ever first time I've ever been on Twitter and the thing or whatever it is. Sorry, you know the um, YouTube, and it was so much joke because I had such a good time, yeah. And Chicken, the experiment is amazing. Starship. He knows him. Starship. Yeah. Starship. Let me just know that, yeah. Right. Yeah. La 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 you can have your mic back now if you want. Awkward. <laughs> Awkward. All right, thanks, bye. All right, thanks, bye, because Tony do his job. I know. 